All right, Brockett, thank you, how are you? Brockett, thank you, how was I? Brockett, thank you, how are you? Brockett, thank you, how was I? Brockett, thank you, how are you? Brockett, thank you, how was I? Baha Sun Racha Kodas. All right, want to give double honors to our apostles, a great millstone, Ruel, and peace and blessings to the house of David, the elect. On Zahab, the spirit went in Judah, of the GMS Mississippi camp. And what I go, in, what I want to go into today is, hey, we're going to enjoy the earth again, man. All right, we are going to enjoy the earth again. All right, because right now we live on, a, we live inside of a corporate grid. We are in Esau's prison system. All right, this matrix. All right, this 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 grid. Like I said, it's a prison. All right, it's a prison for the human soul, for your mind. All right. And just how you go to prison and you got the mystery meat, all right, that's uh, provided to you all right, by way of the warden, all right, we got to consume processed foods, all right, we're subject to payments, all right, that's, that's prison, man, all right, this is a corporate prison, and when you die, when you so-called die, and your spirit leaves your body, and you leave, um, you leave the planet Earth, all right, your spirit is relieved, from this prison, all right, certain family members that you know that have, you know, so-called died and went back to the spirit world, man. And when the spirit left their bodies, they left a prison. They left a, they left a prison within a prison because not only were their bodies a prison, all right, they were living in a prison. And when the spirits ascended, all right, to, to, to Yahweh Shema was shy, all right, they left a prison, all right, because Esau's kingdom is a prison on earth, man. And a lot of times you don't realize it because we have something called entertainment, man. All right. But truth behold, we are inside of a demonic hellhole, man. All right. This is Isaiah 14 and 8. Yea, the fir trees rejoice at thee, and the cedars of Lebanon, saying, Since thou art laid down, no feller has come up against us. All right. Since who is laid down? Since Esau lost his power, man. All right. Because Esau has the mass genocide of the earth. All right, to produce his kingdom, to generate his kingdom. All right, forests have become desolate. All right, because he he wants to mass produce. All right, plants. All right, in towns. All right, uh, production facilities. All right, you 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 you're suffocating the earth to generate money because right, the the forest. All right, is is our is our um oxygen source, man. All right. The forest is our is our life force, man. You got plastic all in the ocean, right? The ocean is our oxygen source, man. It's like seventy to ninety percent of our oxygen comes from the plankton in the in the ocean, man. All right. Like I said, you 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 really don't really understand that this great expanse is our house. And this this is proof that how about Shmuel loves us, man? But he ultimately loves the nation of Israel because. If you sick, he has herbs in the earth. All right, for your food, he has the fruit, the vegetables, the animals, the lawful animals. All right, different stones for different uh, types of healing. All right, only way you could die from starvation on the planet Earth is if you're ignorant. See, we're ignorant because we were born and raised in a fucking corporate prison, man. All right, you go to school twelve years, all right, just to learn how to be a corporate slave. And to be subject to payments. And I keep saying subject to payments. So I might as well bring it out. Um, let me see. Let me get that right quick. The book of Baruch 3. You know. This is Baruch 3 and 8. Behold, we are yet this day in our captivity. This is this is captivity, man. All right? They're talking about becoming a high value man. Why? So you could exchange, have more of Esau's FRNs with his face on it. So we're going to live in a kingdom. All right. We're going to live on a planet Earth that's free of Esau's captivity, man. The Earth is in captivity. God damn it. All right. Baruch 3 and 8. Behold, we are yet this day in our captivity where thou has scattered us for a reproach and a curse. All right, that's why we have something called the news. All right. And that news creates this, this stigma All right, that we're the bad guys, man. Everywhere we go, all right, the, the property goes down, all right. It just a, we got nigger vibes, like that song on Boondocks that used to come out years ago. Don't trust them new niggers over there, leaving their nigger essence in the air, all right. For reproach and a curse to be subject to payments, 
All right, that's not living, man. Because you go anywhere, all right, where Esau uh, dwells, man, and you walk into a restaurant, it's a bunch of Edomites there doing your lunch break. And they're not on a 30-minute lunch break. They're not on a 45-minute lunch break, man. They're not subject to these payments, especially the elites. All right? So Esau sets it up. So if you make enough money, the average Joe Israelite makes enough money to basically pay his bills and his car note and eat, go to sleep and go right back to work, man. See, you're not used to this because all you know is Babylon. You were born and raised in America. All right, you're not supposed to spend your hard work working money on necessities, man. We're supposed to have a system set up to where we build our own houses, all right? We have our own chariots, our horses, all right? You inherit half of that stuff, man. All right, the winter time you chill, all right. That's why doing harvest, all right. Man, the brother was talking about this yesterday. Doing harvest, you're harvesting the the the, the um the vegetation that comes from the earth. A lot of times, <clears throat> you use certain preservative methods, all right, to preserve the food so you can have it throughout winter, so you don't have to work during the winter. All right, you just eat off your preservative preservatives from the harvest harvest, man. That's why you have wine and dried fruit. And, and, and beef jerky, man. All right, but we don't know about that life. All we know is 12 fucking months out of the year, you work, 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 work. All right, and consume processed food. So you got two things that's killing you, man. I'm not even naming the other types of stress that's killing you, okay? All right, according to all the iniquities of our fathers, see, this is a punishment of what our forefathers did back in our homeland. And it was envied the lifestyle of the heathen, man. All right, which departed from our father. That's pretty much the point, man. We're going to get this there in our captivity being made subject to payments. As soon as you get paid, you got to pay bills, man. That's subject to payments, man. All right? But see, in the kingdom, you're going to feel a weight get lifted off your spirit, man. See, we have a look on our face that we're used to um, having, but that's just a, a, a look of being in this grid, man. I was watching this one uh, guy. He has a workout channel, Gone by Publishing. And uh, something came up with the topic, something to the effect of, you know, why why do men look better in prison than out of prison? Then the guy answered him, like, there's no hustle and bustle in prison, man. All right? See, this 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 this, this life, we got to get up prematurely, go fight traffic, deal with toxic demonic employees, all right, coworkers, all right? Work just to be broken, worry about bills. That shit ages you, man. All right? You, you see certain people go on vacation for three days or a week, then they come back, they got a damn glow on their face, man. But what were they doing prior to vacation where they didn't have a glow, man? See, this 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 is a corporate prison. This is a corporate prison for the elites. It's a corporate plantation. And we're nothing but peasants, man. All right? We're nothing but peasants for the Roth, Rothschilds. Peasants for the Rockefellers, man. Peasants for the international bankers. That's why the bank owns your houses, man. Who owns the banks, though? All right? See, see, in the kingdom, we're not going to have a middleman that we have to go through for our survival, man. All right? So, I mean, that's, that's pretty much the point, man. All right? We're not... Let me see. Um, see if I get that in Isaiah. I believe it's Isaiah 10. This is the result of just being... Um, totally dependent on Esau, man. Okay, if I can find this scripture right quick. It is Isaiah ten and twenty, and it shall come to pass in that day. All right, we're looking forward to that day. All right, that the remnant of Israel and such as are escaped of the house of Jacob escape what? Escape from the missiles, man. Thermonuclear destruction. All right, it says, and it shall come to pass in that day that the remnant of Israel and such as are escaped from the house of Jacob shall no more again stay upon him that smote them. See, when you go to work every day, all right, and you protesting for respect, or right, you waiting on your stimulus money, you waiting on your income taxes, you're staying. Stay is another word for depend. You're depending on him that smote us, man. Who was him that smote, smote us? Esau, the so called white man, ultimately, all right, shall no more. Stay upon him that smote them, but shall stay upon Yahweh Bashem Abishai, the Holy One of Israel, in truth. All right? The remnant shall return. Verse 21. The remnant shall return, even if the remnant 
even the remnant of Jacob unto the mighty power. All right. So, I mean, that's pretty much the point, man. We're going to have to depend on this demonic uh, kingdom. All right. For our survival, for our sustenance, man. All right. When most I take Esau out the way and we're going to have stress lifted up from our spirits, man. We're going to have a different, not only we're going to have a different body, we're going to have a, a, a different glow, man, because you, you don't know it, but um, you can't tell because all we know is Babylon, but this is not our natural look, man. All right, this is the look of living, in, living, going to sleep and waking up in stress, man, and in, in, in a low vibration existence, a low vibration of existence, man. All right, like I said, processed food, process is another word for death. You just took the life out the food, so you're eating death. Therefore, you're consuming death, so you're putting death in you, man. All right? You, you, you're dealing with fake money. All right? You're dealing with uh, go out and look for fake women. All right? That, that's not natural. So, you know, to be in the same house with a woman and both of y'all got to go out and work and and, and, and deal, somebody got to pick somebody else, some kids from school and Fight traffic and that's not that's not natural, man. Right, why do you think the majority of the earth is rural? Right? Even when you go to these big cities like New York, uh, Chicago, are right, those are little concentrated areas in the whole state. But the majority of the state is a rural area, man. And right, we're supposed to have more like a rural lifestyle, not this condensed big city lifestyle, man. Alright? This shit it, it, it takes your spirit from you, man, and your health. All right, but uh, like I said, man, that's why it's an inconvenience to re so inconvenience to reproduce. All right, so there's so, so many things wrong with this corporate fucking prison that you're not gonna realize it until you go back to the spirit world, or also when the Most High removes us from this captivity and takes Esau out the picture, man. All right, but when Esau leaves, when Esau gets taken out the picture, we're going to enjoy the earth. And with that, I hope you brothers and sisters were edified. Once again, I want to give all honor and glory to Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shah by Shem, Rakhah, Kodash, the Bahana, so Apostles, Great Millstone, Ruel, Peace and Blessed to the House of David, the Elect. With that, Abba, Abba, Kormi, Asha, Allah, Shalom.